friends. Um, good afternoon. I have a special activity planned for you. Um, you may have dyed pasta a few um, weeks ago with us, and I have the pasta I dyed a few weeks ago. Um, one of the things we can do with that dyed pasta is we can string it and make a necklace. So I have twine that I have here to tie up recyclables. I don't know if you have that. You could also use yarn if you have it. I don't have yarn at my house. I just have the um, twine for the recyclables. So if you um, cut it off and you tie it at one end. Now, if the pasta is big, it may not stop it. You need, may need to put something on the end to make it, to stop it from going off, but tie it on one end. And I'm gonna take a piece of my pasta. Now I specifically dyed pasta that had a hole in it. Not all pasta will work for this. And I'm going to bring it through. Um, and if you don't have pasta, you don't wanna use pasta to string. Um, I just looked in my cupboard and I had honeycomb cereal, which you can use. Um, Cheerios you could use. You could use any kind of Food. And you can also use toys. Um, Clara May is stringing some pasta. Do you want to show what you've done? Nice. Um, I found some toys um, in my Lego box that had holes so I could string toys. Um, so maybe you have some, hole, some toys with holes as well. Um, and then at the end, you could make a bracelet, you could make a necklace. You can make all kinds of things. So that's something you can do for fun. It's good for your little muscles in your hands to be able to string something through. And you know, boys and girls, that we've been stringing things at school for a long time. So sometimes we do it in the morning, we lace things. Um, so I hope you enjoy making a necklace or a bracelet or stringing something along. Um, and have a good afternoon.